What can we learn from aliens about proficiency-based instruction? Imagine that you're an alien and you've just landed on Earth. You're walking along and you come upon a bicycle that's leaning up against a building. You intuitively touch the handlebars and notice that it rolls smoothly because of the round nature of the wheels. I mean, this might not be your alien experience, but something would happen, right? In most instructional designs, we've been trained to teach from start to finish scaffolding each small part of information or skills and students interact with those individual pieces leading up to sort of a big culminating event. But is that really how we learn interacting with the individual processes of the big culminating activity? No, it's not. And it's not what proficiency-based learning is about either. This one small shift can result in better reflection, more efficient learning, increased motivation, and more self-directed learners. I mean, E.T. figured out what to do with a few beers in the fridge without having ever seen them before. He may not have been proficient the first time around, but he certainly learned something from his experience with his interaction the first time around.